In providing my way out of a hole, this is tell it to someone. First question is from Joe Freddy. How do I escape Kansas City? The ro ruby slippers don't work. Well, of course, uh, you, uh, well, technically you're not Kansas in Kansas anymore if you're in Missouri, Kansas City, Missouri. So you've got to get out of Kansas City, Missouri. You take the bridge and then you get to Kansas City, Kansas, which is kind of more Kansas than Kansas City, Missouri itself. Uh, so um, you're stuck. You're stuck unless you find a place um, where you can get out of Kansas City, uh, Missouri without actually um, without actually, you know, um, crossing any bridges, um, which, um, I don't, I, what, what is the bridge over there? It's the, it's the Missouri River. So you can't, so I don't know why you would cross the Missouri River to get into Kansas when you're already in Missouri, which is the bit, the, which is the bit the state is named after, or the river is named after. So, uh, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to um, show me the way to go home. I'm tired and want to go to bed because it's Missouri. It's show me state and. I didn't, I didn't do enough research. I looked it up on Wikipedia and that's what it said. Next question is, I did some research today, so that's a bonus. Next question is for, from Azef. Do you have any pets and what is your favorite animal? Well, I had, I had a, I, I've got two pet cats at the moment and I had ducks. One of them is in that exact pond right there. I know because I can smell the pond. Clean up after yourself, Ebony. Next question is from uh, Jonathan Stern. Why are black dogs the least likely to be adopted? I, I adopted a black dog. Well, I didn't exactly adopt a black dog. Um, the people who I got it from said, um, do you know who owns this black dog? And I did. I know the person who owns the black dog, but that person disappeared. So I, I kind of... I adopted a bright punky Brewster style, except I was an elderly and well, well I was I was three times the dog's age, well, twenty times the dog's age because it was just a puppy. Um, I couldn't find the real owner again, so I had him for seventeen years. Next question is from. It's a fun story, isn't it? He died of some sort of cancer. Next question is um, from Bobby in. Uh, Thanks, Dangerously Talented, for ask, answering my question about the movie Dinosaurs. Another Aussie uh, named Ken Ham got everyone wondering um, about them after he moved to Kentucky. Yeah, well, yeah, don't... If they move to Kentucky, then, you know, that might be a problem. I mean, if they move out of Kentucky and get to... Uh, what borders... Ohio... Yeah, that might be a problem. I mean, I mean, there's no place that you can go to from Kentucky, which is worse, which is not worse than Kentucky, um, except you know, the good bits of Ohio, which is a long way from the from Kentucky. So you're in a problem there. You're in a problem, and I don't know how to get out of this bit. So I'm just going to get on to the next question. See, I'm I'm improvising today as usual and as such sometimes I don't have a way out of a question than just you know hanging uh, no that wasn't my duck that was a more hen um, next question is thank you for distracting from my thing that I my brain stop next question is uh, from the great fish nice end to the video are you still alive no. Great Fish also asks, talking about paradoxin today, paradoxin, like oxen and boxen, paradoxin. It's the plural. Look it up. I didn't because I'm improvising. Um, speaking of uh, paradoxin today, I, uh, I wanted to ask a question about my future self, came through and told me uh, not to if uh, I was to ask the question anyway, would that cause a paradox? Yes. Well, um, all I have to do is tell your future self who I'm talking to right now, because your future self is the one that is in my future and I haven't uploaded this yet and I don't even know whether I'll upload it tonight because internet problems. Thank you. Um, so It was the hot weather, you know, no internet, no um, air conditioning, mate. 
somebody goes something something. Um, so, um, yeah, so all you have to do is, I have to tell your, um, uh, your future self to uh, tell that to you, and therefore the um, causal nexus loop is complete. Just like Hitler killing himself last week. N watch last week's episode, that way I get more views. Next question is uh, from the Gingerhead Man. If I eat myself, would I become twice as big or disappear completely? Ah, well, of course, uh, you would kind of disappear because e eating yourself would involve um, self-death. And as we know from the previous one, that involves going back in time to 1945 and, uh, you know, you know, gun, head, nasty, ow, no, don't do that. Don't eat yourself, um, just eat other things, like um, other things that weren't alive, not, uh, no, that were alive once, like plants and animals and stuff, not people. Don't eat people, unless you count animals as people but are still carnivorous. If you regard as animals as people but are still carnivorous, then um, yeah, you've, you've got other things to deal with, other mental conditions to deal with, because uh, it might be some kind of monster. But I'm not vegan either, but animals aren't people, except for that duck. There she is. You might be able to see her this time. And there she goes. She, she's people, but I didn't eat her. I just ate many of her eggs when she lived here. Next question is the last question for today. Will Disney ever get big enough to buy and convert countries to Disneyland's? If so, what would Australia be renamed to? Of course, well, um, you've got to consider um, a lot of different things. Um, the fact that um, while Disney might be really, really imaginative, um, I'm not being very imaginative today. I mean, I improvised my way through this entire thing and didn't come up with an original thought yet. Possibly. I don't know. I didn't actually listen to myself doing it. I might have said something original. But this time I'm not. I'm going to say Euro Disney because um, the real Euro Disney changed its name away from Euro Disney for some reason. And it's and Australia looks like, looks like Europe except with uh, the... Because mostly... Mostly people are white here, even though the weather is really hot and really sunny and therefore gives us cancer. But we still, we still look Europe anyway, so... Um, Euro Disney. Definitely Euro Disney. For some reason. I explained. This is the dovetail question for next week because um, I... I couldn't think of any other lead into saying that um, because you know my improvisational skills suck tonight because it's too hot it, well it was too hot now it's just um, it's kind of icky damp um, it's it's the end of summer well it was the end of summer it's technically autumn I think um, and um, I'm being rapping on way too long I'm dangerously talented and I don't have a cool sign off